Particular is paying me to tell you how great all of their supplements are and how they will make you live forever. But obviously, homie, don't play that. The No Fake Channel, checking in. Jonathan here with the real deal when it comes to particular supplements. What is snake oil? What is a wicked hard maybe? And what is legit AF? At the end of today's video, I'm also gonna give you my top 10 supplements that I take for longevity and quality of life. It should go without saying that there are thousands of snake oil salesmen online promoting the latest pill that's going to fix all your problems and let you live forever. Just check out their affiliate links in the description. Hey, I even have a particular code Jonathan15 if you're looking to save some money. Most supplement companies are financially incentivizing or even just flat out paying people at best to just endorse their product and at worst to make YouTube videos that look like they have scientifically backed research to endorse a product, but they're just flat out ads. No. <laughs> Particular thought that I was going to dance that dance. It, it became personal with me. But my longtime subscribers already know that I don't play those kind of games. In fact, I usually am brutally honest when it comes to any type of review that I do because I know your hard earned money is just that hard earned. And quite frankly, I had a particularly different type of video in mind. But let's give Particular a fair and balanced review. Let's go through some of the background information. They were actually established in December of 2022. They haven't been in existence for even three years. And the supplement world, that means they are an absolute infant. Particular focuses on longevity supplements. And I actually think that's a good thing that they are specialized. We oftentimes see a lot of supplement companies trying to do a little bit of everything and they're not doing any of it well. Their distributor, whose name I will put there, is based out of Lithuania. They do have a New York address, but from doing any research, I couldn't tell if it was an actual location or headquarters or just a boiler room. Now, to my understanding, Particular doesn't actually make their own supplements. And this should not be a surprise because most supplement companies on the market, they don't make their own supplements either. They don't have a manufacturing plant. They actually outsource that to another bigger plant that actually just slaps their label on the bottle at the end of the assembly line. Now, if you think I'm being overly critical, we've only just started. I actually got some of their supplements sent to me for free. I didn't pay for them and I will say, they're expired already. This one expires in 2024, and I'm sitting here almost the middle of 2025. Keep in mind, when these things are first produced, they've got an 18 to 24 month shelf life. So the fact that this is expired by at least eight months is disturbing. Now, if you go to the particular website, you're gonna notice that they use every marketing technique in the world to get you to buy. And before I go through the list of what they do and how some of it is slightly shady, I do have to be honest and fair and balanced. Most of the supplement companies out here are doing the same exact thing. Hell, most companies in general, even if it is like energy drinks versus shoes, they've got the same type of tactics that they use. The reason being, they work and they work consistently. So number one, as soon as you go to the website, they're gonna have you sign up for the newsletter to get an instant coupon. Now you're kind of locked into all of the random emails they're gonna send you. On top of that, they've got a timer on the random sale that they currently have. That gives you a sense of urgency forcing you to hurry up and make your decision before that timer runs out. News alert, when the timer runs out, another one just starts. Also, if you wanna save some money, you can click on subscribe and save. Now, when it comes to subscribe and save, it's not all bad. I mean, Amazon's been doing it for years, but there is a dark side to subscribe and save. Most of the research shows that predominantly you're gonna be getting months and months of whatever you've subscribed and saved beyond when you are still using it. Oftentimes that's how companies make a ton of extra money because you're gonna just be too lazy to jump through all the hoops to cancel your subscription and a few months minimum are gonna go by and you're gonna get charged getting something that you may not even be using anymore. But I do wanna be fair and balanced when it comes to particular. It's not all smoke and mirrors with them. They do offer a 60 
60-day money-back guarantee. So you could get one of these bottles, use all of it, send them back an empty bottle, and get your money back. And I like when companies give you a money-back guarantee, a window to return the product. It just shows that they're willing to accept anything that you are not happy with in terms of what your expectations are. They also use vegan capsules. And while many people, when they buy pills online, they don't actually think about the digestion process, vegan capsules are the top of the top, cream of the crop. They tend to digest much easier and are more comfortable in your stomach. But let's dive into their actual supplements. And across the board, the majority of their supplements are not only focused on longevity, but focused on increasing NAD, something that has been shown to help improve longevity, quality of life. There is a good amount of research out there that larger, higher amounts of NAD are better than lower amounts. So the idea of taking pills and, and, and in supplements that will allow your body to create more of it is a good thing overall. Now, clearly, you don't want to take my word for it. You want to go on to PubMed or other real websites that are going to give you clinical studies to show this, but the majority of their supplements, again, like NR, NMN, and TMG, actually will um, help you boost your NAD. It will work. I don't know. I can't say with certainty how much of a boost. We're talking 1%, 5%, 100%, and a lot of their supplements as well, which might not be directly involved with boosting NAD, will help with the metabolization of NMN and NAD. I could go on and on about how great particular supplements are and to use my code Jonathan15 in the description. <laughs> But what I'm really gonna do is just take you through what I'm actually using. My goal is to, number one, look good or as good as I can, have a high quality of life so that my joints feel good, I feel energetic, good mood, positive energy, and number three, live as long as I can, like all of us. So I'm gonna give you my top 10 supplements in the order of priority. Number one, multivitamin. This is the free throw shot, the point after attempt, the empty netter. It is something to cover your bases and it is so easy and so inexpensive. I am amazed how many people just don't do it or downright just forget. They've got it in the cupboard and they don't even bother to take it daily. Number two, the most researched supplement ever in existence, creatine monohydrate. It is inexpensive. It has been shown to have very good benefits physically as well as mentally. You don't get to get any fancy type. Creatine monohydrate is flavorless. You can do a scoop, put it in your mouth, wash it down with some water, put it in your drink, your protein shake, whatever you want to do. But you should be doing five grams a day. A lot of people who want to be optimal will do more. I think five to 10 grams. It's so inexpensive that if you're really worried about being optimal, just go 10 grams. Number three, D3 and K2. Now, vitamin D, very, very important for your immune system as well as your body's testosterone functions and hormone levels overall. Now, we wanna take that with K2 so that your body actually absorbs it. Boron, this is something that is very important for men in terms of their testosterone levels, but most of your multivitamins just aren't going to have them and many of your diets aren't gonna have high enough levels of it, so you should be supplementing with it. Number five, and we've got a bit of a trend. This is another vitamin that helps with your immune system as well as your test levels, and that is zinc. Now, you can do this a number of ways. You can just add more food that have zinc in it. You can make sure that you've got a solid multivitamin that has zinc, or like me, I take what's known as ZMA. This is a pre-bed supplement that is zinc, magnesium, and B6. For me, it gives me a deeper sleep, makes me wake up more rested, and it's got plenty of zinc in it. Number six has to be your gut health. That's right. The most overlooked thing ever is your gut biome, whether it's taking prebiotics or probiotics. People never concern themselves about how their gut is actually doing, but it plays a massive role in your overall health and how you feel. Now, you can't take supplements, but you could also get it in your daily diet by taking like a, sub, a fiber supplement, eating garlic, kombucha, yogurt. Number eight is another thing that we say we should do. We know we should do, but we are not. Get seven to eight hours of good quality sleep. 
When you sleep, that's when your body rebuilds your muscle. That's when your body improves your immune system, boosts your testosterone, helps regulate all your hormone functions. And if you're not getting good, deep quality sleep on a consistent basis, you are doing yourself dirty. Number nine, yes, Particular did make the cut. NMN and NR. These supplements have been shown to improve, increase your NAD. And I do think it is something if you are worried about your longevity, about your quality of life, especially as you're getting older, something that you should look into and consider. Obviously, do your own research. Don't listen to the random guy on YouTube. Number 10, omega-3 fatty acids. Now, Listen, we all need to be getting as much as we can in through our diet. I personally try to get in with fish, salmon, sardines, even walnuts, but it is expensive and it is actually pretty hard to get the dosages that you probably should be taking in through your diet. If you are going to be using uh, an omega-3 supplement pill, please do your research. There is a lot of information out there about companies that are bad, that they're basically not giving you what you're paying for, and companies that are using substandard sources. Now, two things that absolutely give you what you pay for, these two videos. Give them a watch, use the links in the description, it supports the channel, hit the subscribe button, and as usual, don't save anything for the trip back.